the sports was a big part of it. They're a sponsor of mine, and a lot of the athletes that uh, broadcast themselves on that network, on that website, fought on my shows. So yeah. We kind of we kind of all work together and, and so forth. So next year's going to be a big. You're doing one. some hybrid shows. You're going to have the make the MMA and boxing at the same time. Yeah, I want to do the hybrids for sure because um, you know we have box we still have boxing fans, believe it or not. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, I'm the voice of reason when it comes to boxing. I see that. I'm I'm Rick, Rick too. It's just yeah. it, 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 uh, my, my appetite doesn't get wetted near as often as I would like it. There's not there's not the boxing. I don't know if it's talent or if it's the put together of it. You just don't see it as often as you see in MMA. You're just hooked on MMA now. I am hooked because on MMA. You're very hooked. But there's a so reason for that. If, if MMA. You're biased at this point. <laughs> with, you're still a little bit. Even as, as down the, the food chain as you guys are from a top rank or a Don King or a Gary Shaw or whatever. You still have difficulty putting together some fights because people, oh, I, you know, I want more money or I want this or I want that, and it just doesn't happen. I mean, you, you, we see TBAs on uh, not just your events, but that means we got a one guy that's willing to fight. We're looking for somebody else who's willing to take it this amount of money at this weight in this number of rounds in this location, and it's all this negotiation on it. And I think really. That's detrimental to boxing. I don't think you would do that if you didn't have to. And you wear a lot of hats, Jake. You do a you do a great job, but to have to go through that, man. Hey, I'm giving you an opportunity. Yeah, how much are you going to pay me to give me this opportunity? Right. You know. And my my manager, my dad, my uncle, my whomever is in the corner, and we got 18 people coming in from Corona. And wait a minute. Mm -hmm. You know, it's been the same thing. This is a four-round boxing event downtown in Las Vegas. It's an MMA show that's in the same position, though. Like an MMA show that. Is not strike force or the UFC. They're going through the same thing. Yeah. It's, I mean? it's like, unfortunate. Like and, and I, I don't think that's a good thing for MMA. But they're getting into that. As the money gets bigger, I don't think. I, I think that 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 can is already opened. Of, of we're never going to get the lid back on it as as they start making more and more money. I think you're, you're right. going to see the same ills that are that have really taken a real swipe at boxing happen to MMA. Absolutely. I think uh, I think in MMA right now, guys are not so selective on who they fight. The MMA has a, has a reputation of they'll fight anyone anytime. Yep. But as the money increases, like like boxing has a you know actually a large amount of money in the top end. Uh, the managers get involved, the business mm -hmm. people become more interested in it, managing fighters. Global and, one coming on. It becomes a marketing thing, watch your record and then it slows the yep. pace down a little bit more. So it, it is it is becoming better. Like the reason that MMA what well, you say MMA but the UFC right now will not have that problem because it's a dictatorship. Yeah, so I mean, so Dana White won't allow that, but, but as do more organizations come out, yeah, they, you know, then the they, politics yeah. gets, gets increasing, it expands exponentially. But here's the deal, they already are, they're already suffering through some of that. Now Brock Lesnar's sick and hurt and had surgery and, I, and whatever, so the fight wasn't going to happen anyhow. But Fedor and Brock Lesnar, it's not put together not because they're afraid of each other, and I don't think Fedor is afraid of anybody, and I, I certainly don't think Lesnar has shied away from, from any kind of challenge or whatever. No. But it's not, it's not happening because of the, well, we want more money, and we want this, and we want that, and we, we want to be top dogs on the billing, on the bill. Well, you're not the one in the ring getting hit. You're, you're not the one in the ring getting kicked or choked or, or arm barred. Yeah, absolutely. And it's the people outside that want their want their part of their money. No. Okay, good. No, you got me. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just going on. Right 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 it's my contact. Sometimes I ain't But I think, I think you can see that can of worms open up now. And Fedor's kind of, and he's the key to that. And, I, and it's unfortunate that the guy doesn't see for the good of the sport. He could force the issue because he could either get rid of, you know, there's he's going to get the same amount of money. Right. 